Once upon a time, in a cozy little cottage nestled at the edge of a sparkling meadow, lived a young girl named Lily. Lily was a dreamer with a heart full of curiosity and a mind brimming with imagination. Every night, as the stars twinkled in the sky, Lily's eyes would sparkle too, for that was the time she loved the most, bedtime. Lily's favorite part of bedtime was the stories her grandmother would tell her. Her grandmother, with her silver hair and twinkling eyes, had a knack for spinning the most magical tales. Lily would snuggle under her soft blankets, her eyes wide with wonder, as the stories unfolded, one night, as the moon shone brightly, Lily's grandmother began a new tale. Once, in a land far, far away, there was a magical forest. The trees whispered secrets, and the animals could talk. She began, Lily's eyes grew big as saucers, and she leaned in closer, eager to hear more. In this forest, there lived a little squirrel named Sammy, her grandmother continued. Sammy had a dream, a dream of flying like the birds that soared high above the trees. Lily gasped in delight. Flying squirrels, Grandma, her grandmother chuckled. Exactly, my dear. Sammy decided to set out on an adventure to find the legendary wings of whimsy, said to grant the wishes of those who dared to believe, Lily's heart raced as she imagined Sammy's journey. Did Sammy find the wings of whimsy? Grandma, let's see, shall we? Her grandmother winked, and so, the tale continued. Sammy faced challenges and made new friends, a wise old owl, a playful bunny, and a gentle deer. Each one taught Sammy valuable lessons about courage, friendship, and believing in oneself. As Lily listened, she could almost see the magical forest in her mind, with its towering trees and colorful flowers. She could hear the rustling leaves and the chirping birds. She felt like she was a part of Sammy's adventure. Weeks passed, and Lily's excitement grew with every bedtime story. She began to have dreams of her own, dreams of exploring enchanted lands, meeting talking animals, and embarking on grand adventures, one night, after another captivating tale, Lily's grandmother looked at her with a twinkle in her eye. My dear Lily, would you like to have your own adventure? Lily's heart skipped a beat. Really? Grandma, her grandmother nodded. Tonight, when you close your eyes, Imagine the most magical place you can think of. Believe with all your heart that you're there, and who knows what might happen, Lily couldn't contain her excitement. That night, as she lay under her cozy blankets, she closed her eyes and imagined a world of wonder, a land of candy-colored skies, talking animals, and endless possibilities, and just like that, as Lily drifted into dreams, she found herself standing at the edge of a sparkling meadow, surrounded by towering trees and vibrant flowers. The animals around her smiled and greeted her like an old friend, a friendly squirrel named Sammy approached Lily. Welcome to the land of dreams, young dreamer, Sammy chirped, 
Lily's eyes widened in amazement. This is incredible, Sammy nodded. Anything is possible here if you believe, Lily spent what felt like an eternity in the dreamland. She danced with fireflies, had tea parties with rabbits, and even took a ride on the back of a graceful deer. As dawn approached, Sammy appeared by her side. It's time to go back, Lily, reluctantly, Lily nodded. Thank you for this amazing adventure, Sammy, as Lily opened her eyes, she was back in her cozy cottage, nestled in her soft blankets. A warm feeling of contentment washed over her, from that night on. Lily continued to have incredible adventures in her dreams. She visited far-off lands, met fantastical creatures, and learned valuable lessons just like Sammy. And every morning, she would excitedly tell her grandmother all about her dreams. Lily grew up to be a young girl with a heart full of wonder and a mind full of creativity. She never lost her love for bedtime stories and the magical dreams they brought, and as she sat by her grandmother's side, telling her tales of her own dreams, her grandmother would smile, knowing that Lily had embraced the spirit of adventure and imagination that had once lived in a little squirrel named Sammy.